to another skill point video. We are in the Maelstrom. Mountain Maelstrom. Oh, that was dumb. I'm uh, being attacked. We are doing the first skill point that I have encountered. I, I tried to do this earlier, but I got my ass kicked because I was like low enough level that he would just kick my ass instantly. One extra level, and I'm actually like able to fight back a little bit. It's working out. It's gonna take a little bit, but we got him nonetheless. Give me, hit me. Yeah! Hit me, hit me. Yes! It's like blocking and evading underwater is even more important than like normal. No, I don't swim away. I'll see my special attack. Yeah. Did he just heal himself? What a fucking asshole. Yeah. Yeah. Blocking all this fool shit. Look at that. seriously taking forever. This would be the kind of time when I would just love for somebody to show up and help. And in videos, that's normally what happens. I normally get really lucky if someone shows up and helps. But I don't think that's going to be the case in this case. Which is fine. Like, I don't think I'm gonna like die. Okay, I might die. No, I won't die. Take it forever. Yeah. Well, he doesn't do that much damage. Like, I, I suck at this game, and I'm fighting just fine. Block it. Yeah. He is healing himself. What an asshole. Evaded sucker. Ooh, that hit me. <laughs> Quit healing yourself, you ass clown. Yeah, you got him. No, don't heal. Don't heal. Don't heal. Yeah, fuck you. Damn, that was intense as hell. Well earned skill points. Jesus. Again, not hard, but he's gonna take a minute. You definitely have to dodge and block and all that crazy shit. Oh my goodness. So, like I said, here's a skill point. I just did this vista. <laughs> and there you go. That is the first skill point of seven. And that one was a pain in the ass. This vista was even a pain in the ass. Oh my god, the rest of the zone. Oh my god. Next clip go. Alright ladies and gents, we're fighting we're fighting the skill. The skill boss. They just kinda of started off and this lady like instantly owned like half his health. I had to get started right away. So yeah. Got it though. Woo! What the fuck man? Level 68 elementalist. Like as soon as they started, half his health was just like obliterated. But anyway, there's the skill point right there. The last skill point we did was right there. It's real easy. And you don't even have to fight anything to get over here. Because they're all neutral. Or not neutral. They're all friendly over here. You just talk to him. And he's like, let's fight. And you're like, yeah, let's fight. And then you guys fight. And then we move on to the next clip. Ladies and gentlemen. Skill point challenge. Let's fight this guy. Oh, shit. He's a little bastard. Main event. Spin, spin, spin. Do all the damage. 
get him away from the water so I can like actually fight him. Oh! This guy's a bit of an asshole. <laughs> Damn, that was epic. So that's, see, that's why I like the Thief. The Thief as a class is a fantastic duelist. Which is really good for 1v1 situations. The only problem is... Is in Guild Wars style of like... I would prefer to do World v World versus regular PvP. Just because it feels more important. But as far as... Uh, by the way, just to kind of show you where it's at while I'm talking. There's the skill point. Right there in this little island. By the Meyer Sea. And here's the last one we did. So, anyway, if there's more than like two people fighting you, maybe even three if you're really good at a thief, if there's more than that, you're fucked. Which I guess that goes for this style of class, but it's usually more than, you know, three. It's very rarely do you actually come across, you know, one or two people in World v. World. Especially doing what I do. I like to uh, snipe camps. They're not camps, uh, supply the supply cattle. It's fun. But anyway, I'm talking too much. On to the next clip. Ladies and gentlemen. Alright. Sweet, an easy one. Hooray. I was like, man, I hope I don't have to fight anything again. I didn't. Here's a skill point right here. This is an easy one to miss because this part is uh, covered up. Yeah, leveled up. Here is the last one we did. Here's the one that uh, we're doing right now. So keep in mind, if you're missing a skill point, this might be the one. And there's where it's located. Right in the center-ish of the map. This part is usually covered up unless you go exploring. So keep that in mind. Same thing with this point of interest, which I will go grab. Forge Foundations. There you go. So anyway, yay, I am 67 now. On to the next clip. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here doing another skill point challenge and it is already underway. And I am fighting whatever the hell it is. I cannot tell because of all the spell effects. It looks like an invisible something. I'm going to spin around and throw daggers at his face. Can't tell what it is. While we're fighting, this is where we are. We're in the infinite, infinite coil reactor. This is where the eternity vault is, whatever it is. The crucible of eternity, yeah. It's really easy to get to, you just follow the path and you'll eventually get to it. Contrary to how the map looks, the place is actually really easy to navigate. And this guy definitely brings some friends. He doesn't really seem to do that much damage, but you'll be here for like an hour. Yeah! Oh, he's like a, a ghosty robot. That's creepy. It's creepy! I'm so little. They're like posing afterwards. Okay. Well, that's weird. Anyway, on to the next clip! Ladies and gentlemen, I'm jumping into a skill point fight in progress. Why? Because they just started. This, these guys aren't so much teaching you how to do stuff as it is how to find it. Yeah! Here's a skill point right here. It is located right down here in the southwestern corner of the map. It's really close to this waypoint, actually. Mark Vale. Yeah! It's real simple. Just one of those, you know. Speak to the thing. He pops up with his two homies. We kill his two homies and him, and you need a skill point. So anyway, there you go. On to our final skill point challenge. Okay, go. I am so glad that this last skill point is just a commune. 
type thing. Because getting here was a bitch. Look at this. I ported from here, swam over, ran through this tunnel, ran through here, met some people here because I died because I fell. So watch out for falling. People revived me. I fought with this one person all the way through here and through here and through here to this waypoint and then fought all the way to here to this skill point. Holy shit! I just noticed there's a vista here too. Fuck! Now I'm probably going to be a pain in the ass. Oh, Jesus. I really hope somebody shows up. And there's a fucking veteran who's here. Who burns. And we're next to lava. No, I fell in the lava. Just trying to dodge his shit. Now I'm on fire. Great. Oh no! What is he doing? Die! Yes! Oh my god, grab this. Fuck yeah! Come here with this place of power! Woo! Fuck yeah, 7 to 7. Suck it. Suck it, world. 87% for the map. This map was awesome, I do have to say. It was simple, straightforward, easy to navigate. And I like that in a map. I still have three more waypoints, two more, three more points of interest. Oh my god, I have two more vistas. Where's the other vista? It's probably over here. So anyway, there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, skill point video. I don't think there's going to be any bonus clips. Um, there weren't any fights around here that were too epic. There's one really long quest chain that you get like crazy amount of XP for. But overall, the quest chain is, in general doesn't really end with any crazy boss fights. Like, there's a boss fight at the end, but it's just kind of like, dude, who takes a shit ton of damage and that's it. He doesn't really do anything special. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I will catch you in the next zone. Bye! Champion Fluffy! I lied, we totally have a bonus clip. This crazy fucking fish. He's not too difficult, but we fought his, like, dad, or whatever. His owner? I don't know what you would call him in this game. His handler. That's Sounds good. good. And now he came after us, so I decided, yeah, fuck it. I've got footage for a bonus clip, so I just finished up the Vista video, and I jumped down, and everyone's fighting this guy, so, you know, I fight him, and it wasn't anything too crazy, it was just mostly, you know, uh, easy boss with a shit ton of XP type fight. Yeah, I definitely recommend being ranged when you fight this guy, because his hitbox is all over the place. Oh no, he's gonna kill me. Yeah, we got him! Can I tame it? <laughs> I have a feeling this doesn't stop here. Yeah, it does! <laughs> okay then. Well, there you go. I thought that was kind of a cool clip. Kind of a surprise bonus clip, so I wasn't really expecting to have any. So, there's that. Um, it'll probably be on the end of the skill points video, like usual. Because, again, the skill points videos are usually shorter than the Vista videos. So there you go. Just a little fun bonus footage. Wasn't a hard fight. Um, you trigger it by just fighting the uh, the guy when he's swimming around. You'll see it pop up. So and so. I can't remember what his name is. but You'll see him. And you should fight him. Because you'll get cool shit. Like I, well, I just got 18,000 XP for killing two dudes that required me to do nothing but spam one and two. So that's pretty awesome. Because honestly, it's not easy to come get XP in this game. Like, you really have to work for it. Because some of the quests are pains in the ass. Wow, I'm so close. To getting 100%. I guess I'll leave you guys on while I get 100%. Oh, that's weird. 
Yeah, 100%. I got this shit that I can, wow, this shit that I can't use, and this shit that I can use. All right, <laughs> nice. I'm definitely selling this on the fucking trading post. Wow, and 14,000 XP. So good. Oh, almost 70. Almost 70. Can almost use these. Damn. Damn, that was a good fucking chest. <laughs> Well, thanks for watching, guys. I'm glad I was able to get you guys that bonus clip. I'm pretty thrilled right now because that was a pretty awesome loot chest I just got. So thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next zone. Bye.